Welcome back to my channel. With now, we are living in digital era. We are working from home, we are working from cafe, we are working from anywhere. So now, having online conferences, it's so much important for our success in our entrepreneurship life or even our professional life. So, you probably already using Google already and you already know Google Meet as well too. So today, I'm gonna show you how you can record your meet conference call with all the other audience even you are using at gmail.com that means you are not using the premium g suite version you are just using something like this so i'm going to show you how to do this how you can record this or every conference call with as many members you have in your call so you want to do that right let's get started Before I start, I want to tell you this. If you are already using G Suite, you have an, another option to do this one. So when you are you're using at gmail.com means you don't have the record options when you're doing the online call. So that's the way I'm going to show you this way to help you out to record. But however, if you're already using G Suite applic paid version, that's great. Look at the top right corner and click through that button and you can see how to make it happens for you how to do that as well too yeah but now i'm going to tell you you're using just only gmail how to do that so when you're using gmail you cannot record directly the recording option you don't have it so how to do that right this is the way such an example i'm in a gmail account right so all i need to do i want to join a meeting first so what to do is start a meeting i can go i can jump to my calendar so canada is popped up i can see I have an online call for discussions. I click through, join the Google. I'm gonna press the join now. Bam, I'm in the call. But now I can see this one in, in, in this version. I have uh, a simple version, which is free version. We have a microphone. I can mute myself. I can in the call and I can turn on the camera by clicking that one. I can actually turn on the caption, which I really enjoy using the, this, this option when I am speaking to someone who's English is not their first language. So that's that really helped them to communicate with them. Now, there's another option we have a present now where I can present any slide with my audience or in, in the video call. But now when I go into this one, there is you can see this one in this option, there is no option for recording. So how I can record this version. So for that, I'm gonna show you a plugin to do this one. So plugin name I have already installed, you can see that screen recorder which is pretty simple. All you need to do is just go to the Google and you say screen recorder, Google Chrome. And you can see the first one will pop in. That's all it. So I have already installed it. If you haven't installed it, so you only need to do is click the button and then you will have it installed. So you'll have it, you will see in the top right corner. If it's not there, it will be there in inside of you. All right. So now all you need is I come in here. So now I need to start the recording by using my this plugin. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to click this button and you can see it's jumping. I want to record the screen. If you take the system, it's going to be recording the system. So now all you need to do is just press start recording. When you press start recording, you can actually select multiple options. You can see the Chrome tab and I'm going to go to jump to the Chrome tab. I'm going to meet and I'm going to I'm going to press shares so now you can see this one is already started to record whatever i'm speaking right now is getting it recorded so let's say example i got multiple parties into it so what i'm speaking you can see this one i my speaking is already been there as a caption and whatever audience is speaking to me i can listen here so now let's say i have just done with my thing so all i need to do you can see this and there's an option here sharing the tab screen recorder or i need to do is stop it when I stop this one, it will jump in and then it will ask me to save it. So I save. When I save, then you can see that there's a little, little file downloaded in my computer. So now all I need to do, I can just shut it off. And now what I need to do is I, when I go to my download option, I can see there is a WebM file has been downloaded in my computer. So what I want to do is I want to convert it to MP4, right? So 
it's more easy for me so what i need to do i will show you this this tool is a cloudconvert.com you can see that in the description this link all you need to do you come in and you add your file here so you can say web mb i'm going to search that file and webbm so you can see this is the file i've just created right now so i'm going to select the file and you can see coming into it and now it's actually asking for type i want to convert to mp4 and i'm going to press the convert button and you can see it's converting it's pretty fast actually maximum it may take 10 to 15 seconds to get your file converted all right, so it's already conversion done and the preview is already open as well too. So all I need to do, actually, I can actually just see see the preview, what I wanted to see it here, or, and then I can actually simply download it. So when I'm downloading this one already, I can come back and you can see MP4. And now I can play in my media player and enjoy my show. So what I am speaking here during the call, it's already coming to in notation over there, announcement. And whatever my participants are speaking is already going to be recorded. Just to tell you one more time, when you are recording, when you're recording, this is very important. When you are turning on the camera option, you put down screen and put down your system. When you put the system means it's actually picking up all the mic, the speaker, whatever speaking into it, is gonna record. And all you need to do is to hit start recording. All right, I would like to say all the best to you guys from moving forward. You can actually record your online conference call by Google Meet as well, too. You don't have to switch to another another Zoom or other thing just because of you cannot record this one. So now even with your free version, you can record too. If you need any other help, feel free to comment below. I'm happy to give you advice. And if you have any questions, put a comment into it. I would love to answer you. I would love to interact with you. All the best.